Hey everyone, welcome to Good Morning Bushwhackers. Today we're going to find out, will it cookie? But before that, remember to like, subscribe, and comment down below, and don't forget to press that notification bell down below. First cookie that we are trying is what, Brent? Nana Berry. Okay, right here we got the Nana Berry cookies. So, let's try it, bud. Three, two, one. Oh, it's so good. I made the cooking batter, so. Mmm. Oh, let's go. I'm gonna make way more of these. Oh, yeah. Now, that's, Nana Berry is uh, pretty much extra. like, imagine uh, the flavor of cross between a prune and uh, a date. Imagine the combination there. And uh, what we did is we actually took sugar cookies and just added the different flavors. Will, Nana Berry's cookie. Yes. Yes. Now the next flavor that we're going for is high bush cranberry. These are not actually cranberries. It's a type of viburnum. So let's try these one. But still, tart. Ready? Oh, that's cool. Oh, man. I try like that one more. Yeah, me too. That tartness from the hybrid cranberries will work really well with all the sugar. Mmm. 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 That's cool. Will Highbush Cranberries cookie? Yes. Yes. Now the next one that we're doing is squirrel fat. We, tuck, we stuck squirrel fat instead of butter. Well, with butter. Let's try this. Oh, gray. Gray squirrel. Well, yeah, gray squirrel fat. No, duh. Yeah, because you're not going to do it with red. Eh, red is too gamey. Ready? Smoke red. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh -huh. Oh yeah. Oh, that's a good cookie. Mmm. It's like pork rinds. Oh yeah, imagine like sticking pork rinds into a cookie. That's 100%, you're right. And, and I think the um, mm. rendered gray scroll fat actually tastes better than the meat. Mm -hmm. I like it where you put it in cooking, mm -hmm. like, like the cookies and stuff, Ooh. you add that a little bit. Wow. I'm almost getting a hint, imagine like, Popcorn. Do you taste that? I'm almost getting like a, that. Like when you finish swallowing it, I taste like popcorn. It's weird, and it's fantastic. Oh, not just popcorn, but like almost like a kettle corn a little bit. Yeah, kettle corn. Well, school fat cookie. Yes, definitely. Well, those were more of the better cookies. Now it gets a little worse. Time for a chanterelle cookie. Let's try this. Get a nice, uh, oh nice, look at the back of that. I'm gonna take that bite right there. I'm gonna take a bite right there. Okay, get a nice mouthful of chanterelles. Ready? I don't taste them. I'll give it a second. It's in there. Be able to trap. I'm fine with that. It's kind of fruity. Not that bit. strong. Hmm. Actually, I don't mind that. I like mushrooms, so. I'm not big on mushrooms. Hmm. Maybe taste another bite. Hmm. You, you thought it was going to be worse than that. Yeah, I thought it was going to be worse. That's it. weird. That's what it's called. Now if we want to uh, make... A little bit of earl thing there, that's weird. If you want to make it worse, we can do lobster mushrooms. <laughs> Maybe another video. Yeah. Uh, now, now it's a little bit weird. But it still work. Will Chanterelle's cookie? Yes. Now, the next cookie that we're doing... Those ain't chocolate chips. That's rockweed. So... We're gonna try some seaweed. That's seaweed. 
Not just any kind of point. It's dried seaweed. So let's try this. It doesn't really smell too much. All right, get 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 a nice good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah I got that bite right there. Uh, we'll go in my bite. Right. Okay, ready? This is crunchy. Mm. Give it a second. It's not that bad. I like seaweed, but not like this. That actually is bad. Oh, you're enjoying it too much. Mm. I kind of like it. Mm. <clears throat> ah, got it down. That was bad. You can have the rest of that. Mm. Mm -mm. It's healthy. Sure. I don't mind it. <laughs> well, seaweed cookie. No. Yes. Okay, the last cookie that we're doing is fish eggs. But not just any fish eggs, pickerel. Now, but what's in these exactly? Now, what I did with the pickerel eggs is I heated them up because they were raw. Like, I'm, we're not gonna do sushi type right now. Yeah, sushi um, cookies, yeah, maybe another one. And I just took a little bit of dark brown sugar and a little bit of teriyaki sauce in a pan and glazed the eggs and thoroughly cooked them. So, glazed fish eggs in a cookie. Let's try it. I'm scared. I'm shaking. Get, get a nice, good, oh, no. thorough, uh, it's, it's sugar, it's, it's nice, good this sugar. This is not it. supposed to go in a cookie. Why did we do this? Because I thought of it. Eh, yeah. <laughs> Ready? Texture's nice. It's nice. Eh. A little chewy. It's good cookie, a little crunchy, chewy kind of texture right, right there. Three, Ready? Three, two, two one. Mm -mm. Mm. 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 This is not a good flavor. Mm -mm. <laughs> Let me taste it one another one piece. You like know fish, I know. I know, I, I actually, not just like, I love to eat fish. Oh, fishy. Let me get fishy the center flavor. a little more. No major fishy, but it's there. You shouldn't have fishy flavor in a cookie. Right? It's kind of weird chewing on the egg like that. I got that. Ugh. Ugh. Oh, none of these are actually not that bad to me. I don't know what's wrong with my taste buds. Oh. Okay. That was oh. weird. But it's not the worst thing I ever had. I've nah. had way worse. Yeah. Okay. So, well, fish eggs cookie. Now, no. That was a unusual flavor experience. Now, how was it, bud? I thought it was pretty good on some of them. That last one was like pushing it. Yeah. Like it, you could swallow it, but you don't want more. Yeah. But I think the best one was that Nana Berry. The Nana Berry? I say, I'm thinking actually the my favorite was the High Bush Cranberry. So that tartness going with all that nutty, sugary flavor would be fantastic. And we thought together, what would be a really good combination, bud? Taking the Nana Berry and a, a little bit of Nana Berry and then a little bit of the High Bush Cranberry and then adding that into the dough and then putting instead of like a oil or a degreaser on the pan, the squirrel fat. And I think that would work out quite good. Great idea. If you want to see more, go down in the description below, click the link to my channel or his channel, or press the round subscribe buttons to both our channels to help both of us to get to a thousand subscribers. And until next time, remember to get outside, get fresh air, and have fun. See ya.